All right, so as you can see, if we go into the crack, it's very OP to just kind of find some little places to hide. A lot of people know about these, but most people don't know just how many there are. Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video. And today I'm gonna be finding all the best hiding spots in Gorilla Tag. But obviously, before we start the video, if you guys just went and liked and subscribed, it'd do me a huge favor. All you have to do is just click two buttons. So go ahead and click both of them. Today we're gonna be joined by my friend Bothmark. Basically, there's going to be quite a few hiding spots today. You might know some of these, but some of these you probably don't know of because they're pretty OP. These hiding spots are mainly good for just hide and seek and all those many games. You know what? Enjoy the video and let's get into the first hiding spot. Alright, so to start off, the first one's gonna be in City. You guys probably all know of this one, because it's the first hiding spot that I feel like a lot of people find. But all you have to do is just come right under here, and then you have like a kind of secret hiding spot. It's pretty useful, but the thing is a lot of people know about it, so it might be a bit harder for you Bruh. to become the last person in hide and seek or something like that. Alright, so the next spot for you guys is in comp. A lot of people don't use comp, so it's going to be pretty easy for you to get away with this hiding spot. So all you're going to want to do is come right up here, and then just hop up where you can see this blue crystal, and just go into this little house. And now that you guys are in this little place, if you just come right under here, there's a really good hiding spot. But the only downside of it is if somebody's looking for you, it might be pretty easy for somebody to point you out. It's pretty easy to see them. Alright, so for the next one, we're gonna see how hard it is for somebody to hide in there and how long it takes us to find them. You can just go hide anywhere in those boxes now. And I'm gonna try to find them. It's time to wait. But today's sponsor is the subscribe button. And this cool magic wand I found. Alright guys, it looks like he's ready, so let's go see how long it takes us to find him, because I'm pretty sure there's some pretty good hiding spots, and it should take me at least 15-20 seconds to find Nobody in here. I don't think he went down here. Alright, this is actually pretty tricky. I'm looking in all these boxes, like right around here, but I still can't find him. Oh, I found you! Look, he's right there. That's actually a good hiding spot. As you can see, the spot that he was hiding, it's probably gonna be pretty hard for somebody to spot you if you get a different color code. Right over here. Bruh. The next best hiding spots is if you're tiny. It's pretty easy to get tiny now, but there are some pretty good ones, so you know what? Let's just get tiny and get to it. Alright, here we go. We can come in now. Alright, so now that we're in here, let's just go down. You gotta make sure you rinse yourself off once you go in so that you're not acidic. Just take some of these Mentos and plop them right into this place. Now we just gotta put the Mentos in here. Oh, there, now that it explodes, we can go off. All right, so now all we gotta do is just walk around here. And the only goal for this is to make sure that you get kind of above. Just wait until all that green stuff down there is above the bottle, and then you can go down and hop down the drain. Hello. No. Naughty. Ooh. Oh wait, it's nearly time to go under that. All right, here we go. The vent. All right, guys, I think it's time to jump in. All right, three, two, one. All right, here we go. We gotta dive. Gotta go quickly. Come on, here's the vent. We can go down it now. All right, here we go. We're good now. Now we just gotta go down this hallway. And it is about time to show you guys the new hiding spots now that we're tiny. Oh, shoot. Guys, I don't know if you can see us, but we're really tiny right now. All right, so the next best hiding spots in Gorilla Tag are right over here. All you gotta do is just climb this little thing right up here. Just climb right over by these bookshelves. Now that you're in here, you can just jump around until you find a hiding spot that you like. Personally, my favorite is right up here. Chill until you see the lava monkeys. <clears throat> All right. What the? Whee! Time to go to the next hiding spot when you're small. Oops, wrong way. Bruh. The next cool hiding spots are over by those glass. <laughs> monkey, 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 monkey. Let's go get the very cool hiding spots. I 
think we're here. We're good. This is the next cool hiding spot if you guys didn't know of this yet. I already did make a YouTube short on this, but this is if you didn't watch that. All you have to do is come right over here, hop down into this little opening, and you're in this little jar. But an even better place to go in is right under this, and then jump up into this tube. Bruh. Next hiding spot time. For the next hiding spot, you're just going to hop right down here onto this computer. Or one of the best hiding spots in Gorilla Tech. You can just jump into the keys and literally nobody will see you. It's probably one of the most OP hiding spots in the entire game. Wait, what the? All right, so to get to the next best hiding spots, it's a bit tricky, but you're gonna have to launch yourself all the way to the Kaji Juice sign. Oh no, I missed. All right, let's try that again. Three, two, one. Oh, come on. All right, I nearly made it, but I made it on top of one of the signs. And I'm pretty sure it's the space one. But these are some pretty good hiding spots. And if you can somehow land yourself onto that light bulb, let's just say you're probably never gonna get tagged. <laughs> All right, guys, it's time to get big again so we can go to the next hiding spots. All right, let's just go back up. All right guys, now just head right over to canyons and there's some pretty good hiding spots in here. The first hiding spots I want to show you about are right over here. You just wanna hop right over here by this twirly zip line. And then if you come right up here, there's a nice little hiding spot. But once again, this hiding spot, I feel like a lot of people know about, but it's pretty fun to just be in here. All right, now we're going to the next hiding spot. Another pretty good hiding spot is right down here. A lot of people don't know about this place, but it's pretty fun. All right, so to get to the next hiding spot, you're just gonna wanna come right down here and put your arm through, and then you can just drop your arm, and then you can just be right here on this pole, and it's pretty cool. All right, so guys, this hiding spot is in Swamp Map. It is very OP. Just get right down here. Here we go. Whoa. All right, the last hiding spot is right over here. As you can see, there's a big crack and you might've seen me just go into some of these during my streams. All right, as you can see, if we go into the crack, it's very OP to just kind of find some little places to hide. A lot of people know about these, but most people don't know just how many there are. As you can see, I'm just hiding in these hiding spots and they're Ooh. very cool. So something pretty fun to do is just to slide down this little hiding spot. It's pretty fun. But yeah, it's just down here. And you can come down pretty far in this one too. It's smaller, but still fun. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe. Also, do you like my magic wand?